During a joint press conference on August 30th, Chicago Mayor Brandon Johnson joined Governor J.B. Pritzker and reiterated a call for the federal government to expedite work permits for asylum seekers in Chicago, adding urgency to this message by emphasizing the city would be unable to support ongoing additions to a migrant population that already totals more than 13,500 if changes aren't made. Joining me to share their well-informed perspectives are Hugo Balta, the host of Three Questions With, and community activist Sarah Sadat. Welcome. Nice to have both of you here Thank uh, you. to talk about Thank this you. really important uh, topic and issue that's going to be with us uh, for a while. T tell me, what are the, the things that concern you the most right now? Hugo, I'll start on the mar migrant crisis. For, for, for me, it's, uh, it's about the people, the people that are being lost. Not only the migrants, um, because we always talk about statistics and the numbers, and it's very important, but these are uh, men and women, families, children, as you've mentioned, and the, the human aspect is lost. An, uh, another group of people that are that's being lost are, are the members of the communities that are being asked to host these migrants that are, I think, rightfully so, um, demanding th that the government, who historically has um, not providing them the resources for them to uh, lift themselves up, so whether it's education, whether it's jobs, they're saying, what about us? And, and, and why are you providing resources for them and not us? And I think those are the people that are being lost in, in this crisis, and they need to continuously surface at the top. They're being spoken about, but not spoken to.